Good morning. We're here in Charters Gateway on the eastern outskirts of Wivelsfield Green, and we're here to see number 16, which is over behind me. But just so you understand where we are, we're right on the edge of the village here, so a lovely semi-rural position. I'm literally on the edge of the development, right next to the bridleway. So literally, if you walk down that path, turn left or right or straight over, you can go and walk for hours with glorious countryside, which links up to uh, Ditchling and Chaley Common Nature Reserves and uh, all the way across to the, uh, around behind the hospice. But the lovely development was built a few years ago by Carla Holmes. They were very well spaced out. They couldn't build anything like as many houses as they wanted to build here. And as you can see, we've got loads of open space, which is good. But it's a lovely, nice development. It's uh, like all these developments now, they're managed. So you pay an estate charge for the upkeep of the grounds. Um, the owner pays £350 a year, and that is to cover all these play areas, the grassed areas, a lot of the roadways and so on. But this house in particular, number 16, is one of the two-bedroom semi-detached houses, um, and it's absolutely immaculate. And it, in my opinion, enjoys probably one of the best positions for a little two-bedroom house. As you can see, the neighbours here, that's a big four-bed. The other side is another big four-bed. And this is the house you're looking at here, number 16. So a nice position. The parking is actually, they've got two parking bays here. And actually, I mean, you could probably get about four cars along here, but I think the others are visitors bays. And that's the open outlook. So what a nice position. Don't really expect that, but uh, the owner is actually one of our colleagues and she had the uh, pick of the plot when she was buying the property and that particularly wanted this one, mainly because of this position. Plenty of parking, but also you've got a south facing garden. So we're here first thing midwinter. The sun's only just coming up and it's obviously behind us. So come and have a look inside. In fact, let's go in the garden first and I can come back round and uh, take my shoes off. Let's hope the gate's open. It is. Got this very handy side area of space. As you can see, they've got uh, rabbits and so on. But look at this garden, nice size. Don't expect that. I mean, this was, again, one of the best plots on the development for a two bed. Um, it's also south facing, but you have got that bit of potential that if you wanted to add a conservatory or something, you've certainly got that room to do it. But all fully enclosed. Uh, the garden measures 33 feet by 30, plus that extra area down the side. So there's plenty of room there. And now come inside. Uh, location wise, you're right on the edge of Wivelsfield Green Village. But the lovely thing is here, you are so close to everything. So on f if you're coming in by car, you're coming over in that corner there. But on foot, literally just across the road there, there's a pathway which leads through to Downsview Drive. That's the shortcut to the pub. Uh, lovely pub, proper pub, serving real food at real prices. Um, good little village delicatessen and store with post office. But the best thing is the primary school. The primary school is why most people want to live in Wivelsfield Green. Um, really friendly, gets super ratings. And is actually also, we're in the Chaley Secondary School catchment area here. So come in. Now the owner had various upgrades on this property, uh, including the flooring. I believe this is Carndine or Antico flooring, but this was done on the ground floor. You'll see the kitchen has been upgraded and better carpets and so on, but it's immaculate yet neutral throughout. So handy cupboard on our left up there. Downstairs loo with a window, all spotlessly clean. And then the kitchen, really nice kitchen. This was the upgraded kitchen. So it's the white high gloss kitchen, got all the appliances built in in here. Fridge freezer, obviously an oven and a gas hob. You've got a washing machine and a dishwasher. I don't know if you're picking up on those sparkles, You've got the black granite worktop with all the sparkles in there, which is really lovely. And a nice outlook over the front. And of course, as you can see, they've only got a little table here, but you've got room for a small table and chairs in here if you want to. And then the living room at the back, even that's a good size. These were well designed. I mean, we sell a lot of new houses and I'm sure a lot of you have viewed some of these new houses, but they're all a bit mean on space. This one was just a little bit bigger than others. Not really expecting a lounge quite as big as this, but this has got it. As you can see, she's got a great big corner sofa. Doors out to the garden. Great for Barbies. And then come upstairs. So hatch the loft up there, airing cupboard over the stairs. And if we go round in order, we've got a bathroom on the left, family bathroom here. Really nicely tiled, proper shower over the bath as well. And again, a window for natural light and ventilation and the vanity unit at the tower rail. Second bedroom, this is the small bedroom, which as you can see is a nice big bedroom. Comes with a, a double bed with cat. 
a lovely big room. Again, that's overlooking the front. And at the back is the entire master suite. So, come in. First things first, you've always got the little dressing area here with a double wardrobe. You could have had a dressing table there as well if you wanted to. Plenty of room for a double bed. That's overlooking the rear garden. It's a shame we're looking into the sunshine at the moment, but gives you an idea. These are the neighbours around the back. And then an ensuite shower room. Again, immaculate, very clean and tidy, all neutral. Got the mirrors in here as well. I meant to say that, that's another extra. But really lovely. So just to sum up, we've got a two bedroom. It's a semi-detached house rather than a terrace. Two parking spaces opposite, south facing garden. Immaculate and neutral throughout. Lots of upgraded spec. Popular little development right on the edge of countryside. You can walk to the village school, walk to the pub, walk to the shop. You can walk to everything. And it's off for sale in immaculate order throughout. If you'd like to come and have a look, please contact our Hayward Teeth office on 01 treble 4, 456 431. Thanks very much.